Yo, you're probably wondering, hey, this uh, Santa Canals, and you're right, this is my lounge, uh, and also hence the Highlanders flag, you know, best super rugby team ever. But um, anyway, I just want to put out there, this fish that I caught in this video, um, about two or three days after we left, I actually got told that this fish swam away. I thought it died, um, I thought it was gone as but. Someone actually f seen the fish kick off and they messaged me on Instagram and says, hey look, this fish actually took off, so stoked with that. And I thought I'd put that just before the video starts. Enjoy this video team and uh, yeah, cheers. Yo. Everyone knows this place. Everyone knows this face. Good or bad. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to a new video. So currently, as you can tell, here at the canals. I'm gonna set you up on the truck because I got some explaining to do. Alright. That's better. So anyway, welcome back to a new video guys. Today I am at the Tikapo Canal and I'm with some friends of mine. Um, we arrived here about an hour and a half ago. I'm um, just some fishing at the fish bowl, my mate got a wee one, which was quite good. And then we come up here to drift some eggs. Within five minutes of drifting, I hooked one and it got off. And then cast it out, hooked up and fought this fish for two minutes, I reckon. Um, and got it in, really good fish, about 18 pounds. Kept it in the water, I even took my shoes and socks off, got him with it. A couple of photos, sent her home and she bloody floated downstream. Chased it for like 400 meters, and you yeah, know, bit of a stitch up. <clears throat> Can't really do too much about it, unfortunately. Um, so, yeah, no, we're fishing anyway. Pretty nice weather, it's not too warm. Old Cam here, I don't think you've ever seen him on the channel. No. Caught his trout <clears throat> up at the bowl, it was probably like three and a half pound. But no, we're just drifting eggs. We're gonna try to get a big Mahi Drysdale, and yeah. Hopefully, fingers crossed, we get onto one and not that shit happens that fish f***s off downstream. So, I've got a bit of footage for you. Enjoy the video. And yeah, I guess uh, tight lines. Yo! Righto, so a lot of people ask me, what is the trick for drifting eggs? Rule number one, look where you're fishing. Rule number two, look at the current. Now, you're not going to use a tiny little weight and fast current because one you're not going to get to the bottom where you need to be fishing eggs and then you're going to have to put a heavier sinker on to get to the bottom but it's not going to stick so you want something that's just tapping away and then also up there you can use a three-way swivel um, I tend to use a wee Pat Swift one but sometimes you have to use it what you've got got a couple of uh, clear drift eggs um, which you can get from your local hunting fishing store and there's yeah, a little sinker that'll just bounce along the bottom. So, cast out. Yeah, about there. You really want to be getting out as far as you can, as close as you can to the other side, but because there's wires over there, um, it can be a bit hard. Mend your line, so keep it off the water. I'm going to get your sinker onto the bottom, which should be about now. Keep your rod low. And then keep your braid and your index, index finger and feel for the bites. Because some of these bites are very, very subtle. And some absolutely pull. So we just walk with it like this. You sort of just feel for it. So it's a feel game. I'm around to the cage, so if there's fish down there, you get in front of them, it should take it. It's always important to keep in line with it as well because if you're too far ahead of it, you can potentially foul hook fish that'll grab it. If you're too far behind it, you're not going to keep up with it. Rod and reel wise, I just use a Daiwa Emeraldus 8 foot 3 um, rod. And then I have my TD Soul from Daiwa. A 6 pound, 6 pound braid on it. And a 6 pound fluorocarbon leader.
Yeah, this is a good fish. Yeah. This is a big fish. This is this is this is big. Yeah. It's gone upstream. Yeah. Yeah. This is a big this is heavy. Yeah. It's gone upstream. Yeah. Yeah, shows that it's actually a pretty decent fish. It's pretty heavy. Holy oh, shit. Holy f. What the f is that? That's a big rainbow. It's a fing tank. Right. It's It's seriously big. Jack, you're on the net, Jack. Jack, Jack, I don't. To be fair, I think the best bet for me is to the bank it. Yeah, watch out, Jack. And I, f I feel like because you're not in gummies. Do you want me to do it? Yeah. Oh, it's just in gummies, I think the shoes are That's a 20 pounder. Ready? Yeah. Are you yeah. recording this? When you go for it? Yeah, I'm recording. Oh, okay. Um, no, I've got to fight him for a bit. Oh, that's crazy. Fucking run through the road. Holy fuck. For fuck's sake, you're fucking tank. How the fuck do you get this shit, bro? <laughs> Yeah, it's a big fish. It's a It's a seriously big fish. Chop, chop, chop. Yeah, yeah, bro. Right, hang on. Right. Come down. That thing's huge. No, 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 no. I'm gonna bank it. Yeah. And I want you to grab its tail. Now, grab its tail. <laughs> get below me. No, get, get below me. Get below me. Get below me. Grab a and drag it in. Yeah. yeah. I might get, we might get the head in the net, maybe. That thing's fucking massive, <laughs> right. when, I, when I get it in the edge, because the it's not going to fit in that net. Yeah, we'll just fuck. Get half of it in there. <clears throat> fucking hell, Dylan. Fuck you. <laughs> I want to get in the 20 pound club, eh? Yeah, I don't know if it'll be 20, it'll be pretty... It'll be 17. Yeah, need it, need it. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yay! Woo! Fuck! <laughs> that's a horse. That's a good fish. That's a good fish. <coughs> no, that's right, it pops out. Just keep him down there. Are you putting them back? Yeah, up? yeah, I can put them back. That is a great fish. Jesus, George. Hey? You caught it? Yeah, yeah, I got the fight. I didn't get the hook up though, but... Oh, he'd be pretty close to 20, I think. Yeah. Oh, yeah, no, that's... She should be pretty close to 20. It's fat as, eh? Yeah. There's that hook right there. It's just fucking knowing what you're doing. Look at that hook right there. He'd probably be... Oh, he'd, no, he'd probably be 19, I think, or maybe 20. That's a beast, eh? Bro, that's sick. Really help you get him out no, I'm just gonna hold him here, eh? He can't, he can't die. He's gotta go back. <sighs> nah, it's probably a four year old fish. Right, that team? That's a fucking team. Wow, look at that. You probably take a photo of me standing there. That's a cracker, eh? Look at that. Look at the thickness on him. Yeah, he's fat. Yeah. Seriously big fish. He'll take off, right? Yeah, yeah, he will. He's pretty keen now, but I just want to make sure. Yeah. Well, team, unfortunately, uh, there was a bit of a mishap with that fish. I know um, most people were going to be like, you could have done this and you could have done that. Well, to be completely honest, I probably couldn't have done anything else. I kept that fish in the water um, the whole entire time. Not the biggest net ever, but it was in the net and it did stay in the water. I even took my shoes and socks off and I got them with it. I wetted my hands and it stayed in the water the whole time, but released it, it took off and it floated down the canal and I'm pretty sure someone scooped it up. 
I actually chased it down the canal for about 300 meters and uh, yeah no no good so you can't really do too much other than sort of just try your best um, and it's not the outcome that you it, as a fisherman you want but shit I'm gonna put this on YouTube and I'm gonna say to people you know everything does not go to plan mishaps do happen and even us fishermen who fish fish the uh, canals as much as we do everyone makes mistakes right let's keep fishing see if we can get another one all right so we finished drifting here um didn't get any more fish oh boothies up the other end and uh yeah guided on someone onto about a 16 pounder so it was a good fish we're gonna go check out Pukeki canal i'm gonna try soft bait it and try to get a big brown big horn Thank you very much. But yeah, anyway, we're going to go with Pukaki Smash. Try to get a big brown or two or three. I'll take anything. But yeah, hey, let's get it. Let's go. A few moments later. How are we? As I said yesterday, yeah, we were going to go down Pukaki for a soft bait. Try to catch a big brown. Didn't go to plan. Didn't get anything. Anyway, um, yeah, said yesterday that we were going to go down Pukaki and try to catch a big brown trout uh, we went down there but yeah didn't have any luck oh, I hooked one rainbow for about four pound and got off but come down to the bowl this morning really good morning nice and calm um, and flicked out the old floating trout nugget just to sit down and park up and whatnot see if we catch a fish this morning before going back and cooking a feed and just picked up like probably like a seven and a half pounder so no really good fish pretty happy with it and uh we just kick them back parked up so check the footage out of this fight all right first fish of the morning it's got weight to it oh yeah oh that's a good fish It's a good fish. Is it a salmon? Yeah. It is, eh? Hey? It is. Oh, it's a rainbow. It's a rainbow. Yeah. Well, it? it's, a, it's a rainbow. Oh, yeah, look at that. It's a beauty. It's a good fish. It might be like, I don't know, seven pound? Six? I don't even see him bite, I just see my rod nearly getting pulled in the freaking water. Just put that net in the water and I'll just bring him to you. <clears throat> so if you, oh, do you want to stand, go down there? No, no, no. Alright. Put the net in the water? Yeah. Sure. You leave him in the water. Just leave him in the water. Yeah, he's a good fish, eh? Yeah. Go, brother. Oh. Ready? Hey. Hopefully he goes. No, I don't know. I don't want to let him go, and then he. Oh no, there we go. Sweet. Yeah, no, he's all good. Mm. Yo. So yeah, that was that, that fish. Now, we're just going to keep fishing. We've all got one on. Whoever hooks up next is, uh, is whoever's up next, I guess. Yeah, well, let's go. He's in. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to be t tight in your drag, bro. He's in. Young herb. What's your drag at? Yeah, it's right. Oh, you probably do a wet potato. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Feel like it gives a feel? Yeah, there you go. Yeah, good man. I love that. When it happens when we're both on the phone, eh? I know. Gotta go! <laughs> Gotta go. Later, Bolt. Yeah. That's only a wee fucker, I think. No, he's not too bad. Is that it? Yeah. No, that's not. Yeah. Oh, oh, no, that's not it. <laughs> that was a big fish, though. 
So I don't think it's a bad fish, bro. Oh, that's a good fish. It's fat as shit. It's a good fish. It's probably five pound. Where's it going? Yeah, yeah. Good stuff, brother. Good man. Fucking, as soon as you rang it, yeah, I was Jack, my fucking my, my rod no. started to cruise down the fucking down the bank. <laughs> That's a good fish. That's bigger than the one you caught yesterday. Yeah. One and a half pound. He's fat as shit. No, it's a rainbow. Don't know. Oh, that's a good fish. It's fat. You want to keep him? He's bleeding anyway. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Fuck, look at the fat, look how fat he is, bro. Nah, he wouldn't be eight. He'd be, be probably six, yeah. That's awesome, bro. Look how fat he is. Fuck, that's been eight. Would that be your biggest trout? Oh, it'd be fucking, yeah, it'd be pushing it. Look at that, look how fat it is. Are you keeping it or putting it in Yeah, he's bleeding. He's fucking chromey, look at Oh, is he bleeding? I'm keeping him anyway. Fuck, look how fat it is. Is he no... Bleeding, is he? Yeah, yeah he's fat. be no good when you put him back. Anyway. He's fat. Yeah, yeah. Jesus, Herb, it's fat. Okay, okay. Yeah, boy. Look at the thickness of this fish. What the heck? <laughs> now we know who ate all the pies. <laughs> look at the thickness of it. Look, look. Look how small his mouth is. Hold him up, bro. <laughs> look at his thick <laughs> back is. <laughs> Like, look at that. It's chunky as, brother. Yeah, boy. Yeah. Well, people, that is it for today. Caught a few more in the morning. Um, and got that one yesterday. But hey, it was a good wee session. A couple of nice trout to the bank, which is all good. So, thanks for watching this video, guys. Make a like, subscribe, drop a comment. And yeah, I guess I'll just see you on the next one. Yo!